Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back. What is happening? There is a very important message for us to know right now, and yes, the rumors are true. We're still cops. Yes. Yes, we are. That was a horrible one, you guys. I'm sorry. I owe you a good one. You know what? Actually, I'll make it up to real you. quick, I'm gonna just go right here. Oh my god. Just quickly change it up. I'm feeling... I still think the, the one you had was the best one. It's too much like I'm like overdoing it at prom. Mm -hmm. Prez? <laughs> I'm gonna I'm just gonna go I'm gonna go with the golden boy. I'm gonna go with the golden boy for All a right. while. Keeping it class. Look, are, for someone who's like trying to not get caught as like an undercover cop. You have to change your clothes constantly or they're gonna catch you. Alright, well uh, let's right. okay, where should we go? <laughs> you you you've done well. You wanna sir. go to the ninth beat or you wanna go to the police station and talk with Rusty? Uh let us go to the ninth beat. All right, that's to go talk to a, to Officer Fred Wallace. Yeah, we're gonna go find him. It's a foot beat. I think he's got that guy's wallet. Fred I Wallace. Took his wa I think he took your wallet. I think he took your wallet, dude. A one-way ticket to Mexico. Old Henry's looking as guilty as a dog next to a pile of dog shit. What's his motive? I can think of a few, but I'd put my money south of the belt. Oh, okay, good job, problems. drivers. Guys, I hope you're aware, aware of Alex's wonderful driving. I'm great at driving. He has never gone to an accident before. Never gotten in an accident. Never got a speeding ticket. Never got a speeding ticket. The only ticket I've ever gotten was a fix it, fi fix it ticket. That ever. I believe. Oh no, I did get I did get a few speeding tickets, but they were really bullshit ones. He was a speed demon. Like I went, I, I crossed the border into Oregon and I didn't know. And the, the and the speed limit went down by 10 miles per hour, and so I was speeding. Like that's I feel like that's a cheap shot. He was speeding quick. He's a speed demon. And then one time I got caught in a speed trap by like a shitty police officer when God, I was like 18. Yeah, it is speed trap. Yeah, it is speed trap. Speed ah. demon. Two guys with the same face running away from a police officer. Wallace, Are you serious? Go, go, go. Wallace, go left. I'm going right after this little prick in the alley. Oh, I think you were supposed to go. Oh, never mind. You got him. Make a right. Make a right. Make a right. Oh my God! You're gonna shoot him? I, if you draw on him, if you draw down on him right, they uh, they get scared. Now they teach you in first-person shooters. That you want to isolate your lines of sight so that only one enemy can see you at a time and then you don't have to worry about getting overwhelmed by gunfire. It's very, uh, very inept to you, man. Inept? Yeah. That means bad. That yeah. Means stupid. Very in depth of you, man. Yeah, that's better. I'll take that. What? A little shooter tip. Guys, Alex knows to shoot a gun. Phelps shooter tips. Uh, driving is still learning, though. No, Definitely dude. A thing I have a perfect still record. Still figuring it out. I always pay my bills. It has nothing to do with what we're talking about. Bad luck for them. I pay my taxes. Still not really discussing the point of how to drive a car. Ever heard of a burglar goes by the name of Jimmy LeBlanc? A 16-year-old kid can drive a car. Graduated high school, no problem. I nabbed Jimmy on a burglary beep a couple of years back. They cut through a music shop and into a jewelry store. We just killed four guys. Four years. Everybody's so Pardon. chill about it. I shot them all in the head. Big guy. I had him cornered, and he picked up this huge display case and threw it out a plate glass window. Then he vaulted out of there like something out of Barnum and Bailey. He got away. I would have had him. So huh. LeBlanc yelling, run for it, Willie. And you think he was an acrobat of some sort? More like a strong man. A wrestler or a boxer, that kind of thing. Thanks. There what the? You haven't done too badly yourself. Yeah, that's right. We murder everyone. That's right. Willie? Or what? Yeah, Willie. I crash into the fence outside, come in and murder everyone inside. That's the way I do it. You're suggesting uh, LeBlanc is still working with Willie? All right. A we got a new POI. While someone administered the Let's board. go talk to Rusty and uh, Mikowski. Ah, great. Our favorite. Our favorite. Dude. Racist duo. Look. Well, no, Bukowski's good. Bukowski's the man. Yeah, he was alright. He was the best partner I ever had. 
He was like the best of the three. Sure. My own guys. How do you like that? Get out of the street! Run! Sir! Run from us. We are the cops. We will hurt you with our car. Yes, run. Run. <laughs> Why are they all running? It's a hot night in LA, baby. Oh, Shit's it's the cops. Happening. I guess we should run. Oh, shit. It's the cops. Dude, Beer Bros homework. Go watch fucking Superbad. I'm gonna watch that tonight. Fuck that. I'm calling you ah! up. That guy's dead. That guy got T-boned. I killed his wife. There's no one in the car except for him. Dude, their head, their head flew off. That's why. You didn't even see. <laughs> we caught up with Mal. He's given us the dope on the Blanc. He worked burglaries with a big guy. Goes by the name of Willie. He might be our killer. Can you work boxing gyms, the Y, promoters, that kind of stuff? Since when have you started giving orders, Phelps? And where's the bird? I outrank you, you no drunk, sm racist smoker. Company. He's not Next drunk stop, right now. Yes, he is. Look at that swagger. Recent burglaries. The guy's a bum. His office is a front, and he's behind on the rent and his phone bill. And he's skipping town tomorrow. Let's get him in and beat it out of him. Do you want to bring in the killer, bro? All right. Yeah, he's, he's drunk. drunk. He's oh, drunk. He's drunk. <laughs> you're right. We've been talking about that, haven't we, boy? Stefan? Finbar? Both of them have lame names. List. Item stolen over the last year. Hang on, I'll dig out a copy for you. Hey, it's our friend. The guy who- The, the I, hangman. I'm glad he decided not to hang himself. The go. hangman. Now we're gonna call him the hangman. So it's more- It's a little ironic. Right yeah. On there. Okay, what are we looking for? Uh... We're looking for... Ms. Page, Decanter, Rimpow, Steinberg, Gene Vaughn, J. James, Beverly Evestrums. Oh, wait, the rings. We can the look. rings, okay. Fabergé gold oh, cigarette case. Okay, so Perfect. cigarette case. No, this. It's here. Arnett must be out of his mind trying to move this while I'm Oh, there must be more. Okay, so the cigarette case, the ring. The ring, the, the sapphire Julia ring. Julia Randall's ring. It's here. That's Julia Randall's. He's then, fucking Mr. Henderson. I knew it. I knew he's Mr. Henderson. And then we gotta find the pearl ring. Yeah, there's the pearl ring. There it is. Oh my god. God! Even the Jesus. Ring was purloined. Our net is a cad. Alright, we got it. And then what else do we need? What else? Is there something else? Uh, oh, the pillbox! The pillbox. Yeah! Oh, dude, there it is. Seems Julia wasn't the first board society girl to hide her bennies in that pillbox. Dude. All right. Tight. That was huge. All right, so. The only place we have left to go is the Eastern re residence. I believe so. This is the one, this is the person who's in, whose name is inside the Fabergé. A cigarette case. Wow, this day was kind of wasted makeup. Let's go do it, bros. You and Rusty have been having discussions. Yeah, we like to talk shit about you because we're both racist. <laughs> Valves, don't be so touchy. Rusty had his best ever clearance rate working with you. Even if the cases he worked on can't be discussed. We were just comparing notes. You're a Boonaroo Fuck you, case, Finbar, what'd you do? One of the best I've ever seen. Thank you, Roy. Thanks. What? You gotta learn to take a compliment, Phelps. We said thank you! Also, we don't trust you because you're a racist. And I know that you're a corrupt cop. A hopped up model, a cat, and you don't and care. a circus freak. Only in LA. That's Fair true. In Los Angeles, we have a great famous. city. More we like love a lot of circus freaks. We love everyone in LA. We have a lot of circus freaks. Except for Steve. Arnett Steve's not welcome in LA. Don't you, go you know who you are, Steve. Together again before they fit oh, them. yeah. Your old pal Rusty. Or should I say Finbar? I wouldn't call him that if I were you. What do you care? Doesn't sound like you're the top of his Christmas card list. He gives That's because I called time. him out on his racism and his drinking and his corrupt topness and Look his laziness and his bad fashion sense and his portliness. You're just gonna you're gonna murder someone with your car. It's okay. I'm with the police. Doesn't mean you're a perfect dick. I'm though. on the case. I am the perfect dick. I'm what the city needs. He just told me I was Bonnaroo at it. No problem. No problem here. Just driving through the streets like you do. 
No problemo, you know what I'm saying? Kimosabi! I have no idea what you're saying. Obviously, you've never seen Lone Ranger. No, I haven't. But somebody did give it to us, didn't they? Yes, on Blu-ray. Yeah, so we should... Uh, for your request. As per my request, which, you know, I thank you. I thank everybody who sent me something stupid and hilarious that I yeah, asked like for. Yeah, like $20 to your PayPal. It's very stupid and hilarious. Look, I never told anyone to actually send me $20. Yes, you did. I always say, please don't send me $20, but... And then, and then you say what you're going to say next. But if you send me $20, what am I going to do? Just not have $20? Send it back. No way. <laughs> it's a gift. I'm not an Indian giver. <laughs> You call that idiot giving? It is. <laughs> idiot giving via donations? Hell yeah, man. Some days, I can't even eat. Nice house. <laughs> what is that? YouTube money's a myth, man. Now, come on, we have a murder to solve. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Just I'm the best cop in Los Angeles. I have no, I have no flaws. I am Guys, this is oh the my best God. cop. This guy has sex with old ladies. Goods to belong to you, ma yes, of course. Hey, man, old ladies need love, too. That's fine, but he's just doing it to get out of them. That's no, messed. You, we have some questions, if you don't mind. Why would I mind, young man? If you are returning 43 pieces of my property. Okay, before 43. we get down to that, I'll have a scotch. Thanks, straight up. Maria, can you get the detective a drink, please? Can you imagine being like, sure, detective, you can have a drink? List of stolen items. All right, let's see what can happens. Describe to us what was stolen. It would be easier to describe what wasn't stolen, detective. <laughs> <laughs> priceless tiara that has been in the family for 50 years. A Fabergé cigarette case that was worth $25,000. Oh my god. Okay, so she lied because that thing was worth $10,000. First of all, right? Yeah. Let me double cheese. Let me double cheese on that. Value yeah. of 10k. So I'm just gonna call her a liar. I'm gonna show her this. Yeah, that's a good call. Okay. Why are you lying about the value of your jewelry, Mrs. Eastrom? Who do you think you are? Making heinous accusations in my own Mrs. Home. Evestrom, I am a Wait. detective! Alex, look at her face. <laughs> ooh, 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 yes. Oh, ooh, okay. Oh, All right. Okay. Look at, oh, look at, oh. look at, look at, look at. We recovered the cigarette case from a pawnbroker. No one knows the real value of an item better than those guys. I inflated its value for the insurance claim. There. Are you satisfied? Yes. Yes, that's why. Oh, judgy, judgy. Taken with the case, I think he was even more disappointed than I was when it was stolen. That's because he took it. He took it. Burglary incident Can you report. Tell us about the burglary. That terrible night, at least a year ago. But let's not go into that. Let's talk about what you've recovered. No, I want to talk about the burglary. Well. She doesn't look shady. No, she's telling the truth. Why would she have to lie about that? Right. Were you in the house when the burglary took place? Good heavens, no. I was at a social function held by a Dr. Harold Stoneman and his What the fuck? Oh, yeah, huh? I returned home and all of my things were missing. So Stoneman's working? That's about it for now, Mrs. Eastrom. The department will get in touch. So Stoneman's I working with articles. him? What did you do to Stoneman? A few of the items that have been stolen, Detective. What else has been recovered? You see, Phelps, that's why you get the drinks in early. Hello, Mother. Hello, Detectives. What is going on? We'd like to ask exactly the same question. You have met my daughter this morning at work. Oh, mother and father divorced. I took my father's name. The detectives. Recovered some of the things that were stolen, darling. Well, what did you find? A sapphire ring on the corpse of Julia Randall. What are you talking about? Your engagement ring, Miss Swanson. Would you be surprised to know that it was part of the proceeds of a burglary? That's an outrageous allegation. Yes, Nobody it is. wants to listen to the truth, to from, even when it's the golden boy telling out. it. 
Oh. What? This is like we're so. Cool. We're gonna go confront him. Yeah. Okay, Alex. No, I don't mean to be rude. There's a woman in the car. There's a woman in the car. I. Woman in the. What are you doing? I just need to get the. Okay. Uh, just need okay. To get the. Uh, sure. Registered address locked just in. Just be real cool. Be real. <laughs> that really was cool. That was not in any way my fault. This is the first time we've ever had another person in the I back seat. There you go. Okay. That's my fiance you're making scurrilous accusations about. We're trying to keep you can alive you in the car. Stop yelling at me, please. Oh, Alex. Oof. But neither of them are the type Oof. to creep apart. I can't I can't watch you drive. Why? It's ridiculous. just it's too I'm much. great at Both driving. You, there's there's a very good explanation for all of this. No. What a sock in its sister. It doesn't matter what it is. It's against the law. Smart enough to see it. Unless you're going to tell me something right now. What? Is your boyfriend's apartment in, like, an abandoned part of town? Hill Valley. <laughs> Biff Tannins, Hill Valley. Butthead. I'm gonna kill the alarm. Because it makes me feel crazy. Okay. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna just go here. Take a left. Beauty, beauty, beauty. Take your time. Mm. Don't hit anyone. Oh boy, oh boy, here we go. Yep. Everybody's fine. Everybody's fine. Nobody's in trouble. The woman is alive. What? You just Because I have a I have a timetable to keep. What are you talking about? We only have 30 minutes of episode per episode, and I don't want to spend it just slowly driving around the streets of Los Angeles obeying the rules. <laughs> you, know, you know what I mean? You don't have to obey the rules, Look but you didn't need to rear at the person in front of you. You don't understand how hard faster. it is. You don't even understand how hard it is to drive these terrible Beer cars. Beer Bros bonus video. I'm going to drive. Okay. I'm going to drive at the end of the series. I'm going right. to drive for 10 minutes so I can experience drive. your pain. It's, uh, okay, yeah. You know what I want you to do? What? We're going to do a video where we do the chase. You, we're gonna, you're going to okay. do a chase. You're going to chase. I will, I will, re we will replay a mission. You will, we're going to chase, gonna chase someone. Yeah. That's the Beer Bros bonus so far. That's what it's going to be. That's what it's going to be. Also, like, what's going to happen? Are we going to, like, play all the, like, little missions in this series? No, we're just doing this for the plot. I will do all that stuff on my own time because I'm at the completion of it. Well, maybe we'll do like a little bit of it just to show you guys what it's all about. To show you like- We've already done stuff like this Well, though. like, there's like a car collection thing. <laughs> there's a car collecting you thing. You didn't even feel remorse. <laughs> are we in Santa Monica right now? Is that where we're at? I don't know where we are. I don't recognize any of this because it looks so different. This is Kohanga. This is Kohanga? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. We could be right. in Hollywood. It looks like it might be Hollywood. This is, uh, Coenga and I can't see what the street is. Right. Um, what is that? Wilcox? Coenga and Wilcox? We're, like, pretty close to, to, uh, comedy sports right now. The new location or the old location? The old location. Off of SeaWorld? Yep. I doubt that it's gonna be- I, I- I thought it was, like, map accurate, but I don't think it is. I thought L.A. Noir was, like, map accurate, but I- I, I really don't think it is. Especially considering the, uh, Tar pits. Yeah. And this car ride is very quiet. No sure one's saying a word. Is. She's real convinced that we're wrong. Yeah, she's stupid. But Either she, she's in on it and she doesn't see what's wrong with it, or she's in denial at this point. I'm gonna say, oh. Clean. Not clean. Very not clean. Super clean. One of the worst times. You've no, driven. not even. You don't even remember the salt pile. Okay, I remember the salt pile though. <laughs> Come on, sister. Let's find out who your fiance really is. You were gonna get married Wait, to a guy. Go who back. Was that a newspaper on the? Yeah, I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a. It's a. It's just a. Oh, it's like one of these. Like I can like be all sly here. I guess you can't, but. Just one on the other. That one over there, so no? I think you're spinning newspaper. Oh, you think like... Can you find Flashback. those? Can you find those like not when there's clues? I don't think so. Oh, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Okay, so we're gonna look for Mr. Arnett's apartment. Mr. Arnett! A car now! I'm sorry, are you a resident? No, I'm a cop. LAPD detectives. We're here to speak to Henry Arnett. Oh, uh, Mr. Arnett? Um... Uh, apartment 30. 
You can take the lift. Why don't you come with us? Just like Michael Jackson over. Dude, this elevator is like beautiful. Isn't this just nice and awkward? It's only nice and awkward if you make it nice and awkward, okay? Well, I mean, we are like taking her to like go arrest her boyfriend. Yeah. That's pretty awkward. Why is he holding on to her like that? Come on, dude. It's oh. The 40s. Oh. Oh no. Stop. LAPD. Call this guy's our case. Go on, Put your on, hands go. in the air. Oh my god. Oh my god, the chase. The chase. How much you want to make a bet I start running the other way on one of these ladders? No, you're fine. Give it up. LAPD. Slide boys. There you go. Where do you go? Where do you go? Go up, go up. Don't let him get away. Oh my god. Don't make me chase you. I can it's already what's happening. Oh my god. Just do it. 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 This is do so it. shitty. Just do it. It's like the last thing I want to do in the middle of a it's chase. It's an ice oh my bucket god. challenge. An ice bucket challenge. <laughs> do it. Just, Just do, do it. it. <laughs> he got it's away? A rise about this challenge. A rise awareness challenge. <laughs> Looks like he got you good, Phelps. Yeah, he really packs a wallop. Hit me in the head with a board. Under your own steam, miraculously. He came in through the window, Why did it make me do that balance thing and if I was just gonna get knocked out right after? That was our net. He's coming around too. He's all hopped up. Good time. On Mountain Dew! <laughs> you missing something, Henry? Hey Henry. Alright, gotta find some clues. Some castanets. Doesn't tell me anything. <laughs> Except that he loves Latin rhythms. That's a newspaper, eh? It looks like it should be, but no, no. We're probably gonna have to find the ticket that he bought to Mexico. Right. That's got to be it. Like maybe his. What's this? A flashlight? A gigantic screw. <laughs> <laughs> a cartoonishly large screw. Not much. From help. Ratchet and Clank. <laughs> So rise, buck this judge. Just do it. <laughs> do it. Do it. Just do it. Go watch yeah. the new malicious. <laughs> we, already, we already did that for Beer Bros homework once. I don't care. Do it again. If you, even if you fully. Please wave it. Please wave it. <laughs> hey, Arnett. So unnatural. Hey, Arnett, you're a little hot. Arnett, do you fuck boys with this with this fan? You fuck young boys, Arnett. <laughs> I wish there was an option to ask everyone that. <laughs> L.A. Noir, or L.A. Noir, pedophile edition. L.A. Noir, uh, Just freaking, uh, what's that show? To Catch a Predator. <laughs> this guy has nothing to pick up in his whole fucking house. <laughs> There's nothing, this guy's house is this empty. Pillow, this pillow here seems pretty We're ominous. We're in Ricky Ricardo's bedroom. Circumstantial. <laughs> you know how many times that the matchbook has been the crack in the fucking case? <laughs> it's been like six yeah. cases. Drugs. Oh, it's a cigarette. Cigar. Maybe if Is it a bullet? No. No, it's a it's a like it's a butt of a cigar. Oh, it looks like a shotgun shell. <laughs> oh, he's got a Red Bull on his Brand marketing from the- wait, go back. Is that literally a Red Bull? I don't think so, but it looks up. a lot like a Red Bull. That turn- oh, it looks like it's salt of some kind. Like a- like a tea or salt or perfume or something. Yeah. Alright, that's- No. No. We gotta go back inside. Do it. Just do- maybe it's like near him. Like, maybe it's just like- we're overthinking it, you know what I mean? I'll we'll have to talk to him, but... Oh. There's just nothing here. There's nothing There's gotta house. be something. Those are the castanets again. I really... Oh my god. So dumb. Alright. What?! Alright, so let's look at his Apple Watch first. 
It's one of the stolen items. Asheron Constantine. It's an extremely oh, shit. expensive watch, Henry. A graduation present from my parents. Oh yeah, from what shit high? Yeah, from fucking from Okinawa. From what shit high? Okinawa College. Okinawa shit high college. Shit high. Go with me on that bit, all right? Shit high. So stupid. Is that it? Did we get it? Did it say anything? Wait, it didn't do like a little update thing, did it? It's literally just a train ticket. Mexico City. Can you like turn it around or anything like that? No. Zelda. 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 Dude, he has a samurai sword in his house and a gun. Alright, so I just talk, talk, talk to him. All Professional right. burglary ring. You are a thief. We know all about the jewelry ring. You and Randall and the Blanc and Willie doing the legwork. I'm in the fashion business. <sighs> I'm in the fashion business. <laughs> All right, so let's see. What do we got? What did he? Hold on. Can you go to the log real quick? Ah, uh, what? Go to the log. Uh, yeah. You want to see if it like says like. I'm in the gulp. We know what the Julia ring. You and Randall and LeBlanc and Willie are doing the leg work. I'm in the fashion business. I just want to point out, before you even start, you can put, 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 press pause for a second, just so we're not wasting time. In the, in the, as a human being, if you're being interviewed by the cops, and right, they're like, we know everything. And your response is, I'm in the fashion business. I'm not a thief at all. I am not. A, this is like the assassin thing all over again. You guys are wrong. I am wrong. not an assassin. You guys are I am wrong. A I am a fashion business. I'm in the fashion business. Here's the thing. Fuck you, dude. You are you not in the fashion business. I and walked if you are, behind you. Listen, I walked behind you for miles and miles and drove behind you in a car. And you took a stolen cigarette case and you pawned it for money in a shop. I saw you do it. And you bought a one-way <laughs> ticket to fucking Mexico. Mexico City. Yeah. Explain that to your fiance. Yeah. All right. Take this man down a notch. You're lying. You're, to, you're lying. You're lying, Henry. I love Cole Phelps right now. How can prove that I'm involved, detective? Ooh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> You also did the most guilty gulp I've ever seen in the history of gulps. Beer Bros homework. Fucking take that guy's face and put it on a 7-up big gulp. God damn it. Find out where and when and then have the guests burgle. Julia was desperate for money. No matter how much we made, she always wanted more. Oh. This woman is like finding out so much about everything. Motive for Randall's murder. Let's go. Yeah. Why'd you do it? Why'd you do Why it? Reed and LeBlanc kill Julia Randall. I, I wanted to stop to, to get out of that life. I was going to marry Heather if she'd have it. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> told the others that, that they were out. That okay, hold on a second, buddy. New gang. Hold on. Oh, my God. If you wanted to marry the woman you loved. Why? Why would you get a one-way ticket <laughs> to New Mexico? <laughs> I love her so much. Look at him. <laughs> I love her so much. Right. I want to go away to Mexico. Right. Should I call him on it? He's a fucking liar. <laughs> lying, Arnett. I think you ordered them to kill her. It was made to look like suicide, and when the coroner saw through that, he knew it was time to run. I told you I was involved in the burglaries. I had nothing to do with Julia's death. You're Why would so I need to run? Shit. <laughs> How do you know I was gonna run? What could you have possibly found sitting in this suitcase right next to me that I? Get the one-way ticket to Mexico. That you're from Mexico City tomorrow Idiot. night. That it's a one-way ticket. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I hope he like drops and, and starts having like a New Jersey I accent. Marry Heather. Oh, I yeah, my name's Frank. I out and she laughed in my face. You got me. Oh my god. Billy and Jimmy a fortune to do her and now I'm completely broke. What you are, Buster, is under arrest. <laughs> what you are, Buster. Daddy, Mr. Henderson. So Who is Henderson and what is his involvement? It's you. Tell them what you know, Henry. I'll stand by you if you'll only tell the truth. There is no Henderson. 
You're bad at lying. <laughs> You're so bad at lying. Look there at has this. to be. Hold on. There has to be a Henderson. There because, has to be because of the jacket. Well, no, we have the jacket, and well, okay. Let's let's look at our facts. Right, our our, our 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 go the contraband list. Right, it has like a list of people who, who like bought things from a store. Right. Yeah. Henderson's name was on that list. Okay. Right? Maybe he stole the jacket. Okay, so okay, so you're saying I should I should call him on it and use the the list with Henderson's name on it? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Is that a far-fetched uh I mean, it's a little like I'm it, it was it definitely on there? I'm pretty sure it was. Is there anything I can like kind of look at this? Damn. Press start. Is there a way to... There's just stats. Log. Yeah. Should I really take a jump on this? Do you saw it on there? I'm pretty sure I did. You know, I don't know, a big fat liar and we lose the case. All right. All right, I'm going to call him a liar. Yeah. Tell me about your first burglary and don't lie. I can't remember. I don't keep a list of these things. You don't remember your first burglary? You don't keep a list of your burglaries? I feel better about this now. Your first burglary was a Dr. Harold Stoneman. Do you want to explain how he is involved or shall I? Henderson is Stoneman. He was crazy about Julia. <laughs> what? She could get him to do whatever she wished. He threw the parties and we arranged the burglaries. Done. Handled. Julia never let him touch her. She just... Kept him hanging on the promise. Drove the good doctor almost insane. Got him. Henry Arnett, you are under arrest for burglary and for the murder of Julia Randall. Henderson is Stoneman, all right? I'm not the guy you want. Go talk to the good doctor. You oh, killed her. Will, knucklehead. Meanwhile, you killed her. You, you, you hired a hit person. You hired a hit Ladies man. Ladies and gentlemen, we have found the worst character this in this game. This guy's the worst criminal He's of all time. He's the worst criminal of all ass. time. He's, he's, oh my god. I can't even begin to tell you. Oh! What? Oh! oh! <laughs> 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 you should, he should be dead. All right, guys. Uh, rip, we'll rip be cop. We'll be back next time with more of this fucked up case that just keeps getting worse and worse. <laughs> next time, we're going to be headed over to we're gonna go Dr. Stoneman's, Stoneman's practice. practice. We'll see Holy you there in shit. a few days or whatever. <laughs> Later, Later, man. man.